Several groups in just the Plateau State Capital have given the Nigerian military a seven-day ultimatum to produce the killer of 300-level students of University of Jos Rinji Bala. While leading a solidarity protest to the residents of the late student who was shot by an operative of the Special Task Force Operation Safe Haven in Jos, the Plateau State Capital, they said enough is enough of extrajudicial killings in the, in the mining city of Jos. We come as a family and say we have forgiven whoever has done this. We have forgiven whoever has done this. That God is there watching and God will definitely deal with whoever has done this. However, however, the law is there. The law must take its course. We, as a family, we have forgiven. But in the course of the law taking its uh, discourse, we want to advise that the fragile peace that we are enjoying, please, it shall not be curtailed or derailed. After the next seven days, we are demanding that the name of the culprit should be pub uh, published with his photo. We want to see it. We are not operating in a close a government in Nigeria. We are in open governance now in Nigeria. Ringin is not the first incident, and he may probably may not be the last if we don't do something. So if uniformed men can shoot and kill citizens, I think they should also understand that we can equally protest. Yes. We are respecting them, I think, for the last time. Yes. The next time another security personnel shoots and kills a plateau citizen, we want to assure you that we have the capacity to barricade all your offices. We will do that in a peaceful manner. Uh, we want to state this, that uh, this time around, Nigerian Bar Association will take it upon itself. Whatever it will take, it will take us. We will make sure that we get justice for Rinch. Uh, my visit uh, to the STF command uh, operation is basically uh, to have an interaction uh, the command on recent events, uh, on the sudden death of, uh, of my constituent uh, Rinji, uh, who was uh, accidentally shot, and uh, our interaction, I must appreciate uh, the command for being so honest to tell us uh, the real situation of what happened and uh, the assurances I got uh, from, from him uh, with the fact that they have already even put uh, uh, an inquiry uh, on ground to be able to investigate what really happened.